How do I fix email authentication errors? Are you struggling with email authentication errors? You're not alone. These errors can be frustrating, especially when you need to send or receive important messages. Let's break down how to tackle these issues effectively. First, it's essential to understand what email authentication means. This process ensures that your email client can prove your identity to the server. It typically involves entering your username and password, along with checking security certificates and server names. One of the most common reasons for authentication errors is a mistyped password or username. Take a moment to double check your login details. If you have recently changed your password, make sure to update it in your email client settings. Another frequent issue is a certificate name mismatch. This occurs when the security certificate on the mail server does not match the domain name your email client expects. For instance, if you are using your own domain for the mail server, but the certificate is for your hosting provider's server, you may see a warning. In most cases, you can proceed by accepting the warning. However, for better security, consider requesting a certificate that matches your domain. If your email client uses Secure Sockets Layer or Transport Layer security settings, ensure these are correctly configured. Using the wrong server address or port can also lead to authentication errors. Check your email provider's setup guide for the correct settings. Email authentication errors can also be linked to security protocols like Sender Policy Framework, Domainkey's Identified Mail, and Domain-Based Message Authentication, Reporting, and Conformance. These protocols help prevent email spoofing and ensure your emails are delivered. If your domain's domain name system records are not set up correctly, your emails may be rejected or marked as spam. Review your domain name system settings to ensure your sender policy framework, domain keys identified mail, and domain-based message authentication, reporting, and conformance records are properly configured. Sometimes, temporary authentication errors can occur if you send too many emails in a short time. This can trigger rate limits or temporary blocks. If you think this might be the case, wait a little while and try again. If you are still facing authentication errors, consider these steps. First, verify your login credentials. Next, check your email client's server and port settings. Review any certificate warnings and ensure your domain name matches the certificate. Confirm that your domain name system records for sender policy framework, domain keys identified mail, and domain-based message authentication, reporting, and conformance are correct. Avoid sending too many emails at once to prevent hitting rate limits. If the problem persists, don't hesitate to contact your email provider's support team for further assistance. By following these steps, you can resolve most email authentication errors and keep your email client running smoothly. Regularly updating your software and following your provider's recommendations will also help maintain a seamless email experience.